Move it out, Shiv. Oh, oh yeah. Hero, huh? Identifying prisoner 117. Shiv, Helix. You think you can break me, copper? Yeah, I've been in the darkest pits of the universe. Places that would make your vaults rattle. The eternity pits of sword doom. The iron holds in your balance. Nah. Greetings, new fish. I'm Captain Quark. I I don't believe it. You're here. I used to dream of being arrested by you. Now get out of here. I was talking to you, Zed. Yes, Captain. So, new fish, I take it you followed my many, many adventures? Of course I have. You're the most famous superhero in the galaxy. He ain't famous anymore. <laughs> Words hurt, solitary Bill. I'm a huge fan. I even pre-ordered the new Ratchet and Clank Hollow game. The what? You know, the game based on that incident with you and that Lombax. Oh, you must mean the Hollow film. Yeah, it's pretty good. If you like all CG. No, I mean the game. It's based on the Hollow film. Look, here's my confirmation email. I'm having it mag shipped to prison. <laughs> They're making a game based on the Hollow film based on my life? But they haven't even consulted me. Oh, this is my fault. I've been away from my adoring public in this forsaken place too long. And now, no one will ever hear my side. I'd like to hear your side, Captain. You would? Well, then sit down, wary criminal, and I'll tell you a story. It all started with a hapless lombax named Ratchet. <laughs> Think you're going? Hey, Grim, you're here. I I thought you'd be down at the bazaar shopping for gravity coils. Uh huh. Well, I'm here. I'm always here. I don't suppose you sneaking out would have anything to do with those Galactic Ranger tryouts? I just need one hour. Come on, Grim. These are the Galactic Rangers we're talking about. Captain Quark will be there. No leaving the garage until you help fix Mr. Micron's ship. Now get on that bolt crank. Does that ship look mag-lifted to you? Get on that fault crank, come on! Look at this thing. Avionics fried, CPU fried, even the gosh darn gravity coils fried! Oh, you really just... Okay, let's see if these new Versa bulbs work. Look up, do you see something flashing? Come on, give it a spin. Look up. Do you see something flash? Yep. Left side looks good. It's a miracle. On to the afterburner lights. Look down. You see something? Lower left afterburner light checks out. This thing might just be space worthy after all. One more to the right. Lower right afterburner works. So, are we good? Yep, we're good. The news says the tryouts are being held at the fairgrounds. Show them what you got, kid. And so Ratchet began his adventure, hoping to become a galactic ranger. Still don't see why you'd want to leave all this behind. Friendly people, beautiful desert, all the barbecued sand toads you could ever eat. Some people don't appreciate what they have, I suppose. Rise and shine, Kizzle Pluto. It's 8 a.m. and it's going to be a hot one today. Ratchet bashed his enemies using his trusty Omni Wrench.
In order to best his foes, Ratchet used the warrior's time-honored tradition of jumping. Mortal peril. Should he find himself on the verge of death, he'd need to find nanotech to heal. <laughs> I used that stuff after a bank robbery once. It healed like three out of five gunshot wounds. <laughs> Displayed a flagrant disregard for public property. Look at him smashing crates. <laughs> the hubris. Maybe he was just saving up bolts so he could buy a new weapon to protect the galaxy with. Hey, who's telling the story? <laughs> Destination? Destiny. as evidenced by the large amounts of ammunition left sitting around in crates.
wanted to spice things up, we've armed these dummies with Gadgetron flamethrowers. Our lawyers are totally cool with this. Look, up here. It's me, Captain Cork. Well, it's not really me, just a flip with a pre-recorded message of me. But I'm sure it's thrilling nonetheless. Good job, recruits. You may just be the next Galactic Ranger. Head to the final challenge. Come on, Ratchet. You can do this. Time for the final challenge. Survive a brutal onslaught of enemies, and you just might be our next Galactic Ranger. Or... One down. Another one down. Whoa. Looks like some angry toads. Could we be looking at Solana's next Galactic Ranger? Copernicus Quark, and yes, that was an impressive wall of fire I just walked past. I'm gonna be real with you folks for a moment. When President Byronics recommended I take on a new ranger, I knew just where to go. That's right. We want you! Yeah. I know what you're thinking. Do I have what it takes? After all, you may not have prevented Dr. Nefarious from atomizing Illyro City. You may not have stopped Neptun Prague from rendering the entire population of Aradia colorblind. Twice. After all, you may not have this chiseled jaw or godlike pectoral region, but if you have heart, then you have what it takes. You don't have what it takes. But I have heart. Yes, but unfortunately, that heart is encased in a weak, muscleless mass of inexperience. Plus, there's your history to consider. Got a long line of citations here. Possession of an illegal gravity repulsor. Operation of a black market accelerator. Willful disruption of the space time continuum. That is a funny story. You're reckless. You're a loose cannon, and you're dangerous. That's my shtick. Wait, God. Just give me a chance. Sorry, no time. Galaxy in jeopardy. Get back out there. And remember, you can do anything. As long as you're me. Next! Meanwhile, on planet Quartu... Dr. Nefarious. The mad scientist who made all of this possible. Mad suggests cognitive impairment. I'm more of a vengeful scientist. I trust you're here to meet the troops. Hmm. <laughs> State your prime objective. Destroy Galactic Rangers. State your prime objective. Destroy Galactic Rangers. State your prime up. Hmm. Hello. Defect detected. Preparing for immediate destruction. In three, two. Oh, a defect. Go play, Victor. Defect knew that his best chance for survival lay with the facility's ventilation system. If he could just run to the vent, he might just make it out of there alive. I know you will find the defect, Victor. You never disappoint. Defect knew that if he were to survive, he would have to throw a bomb at whatever lay in his path. 
The young defect spotted a spring bot ahead of him and knew that with this handy device in his arsenal, he could now defeat the deadliest of forces, gravity. The hopeless defect had to throw a spring bot. But where? And how? You're running, you useless piece of scrap! Get back here and let's settle this! Warbot to Warbot! for my liking. Suddenly, the defect spotted a power box. This device could power up a variety of machines, but where should he throw it? <laughs> You're, like, really good at adding drama, man. Thank you, Shiv. I pride myself on my penchant for storytelling. What seems to be the problem, Victor? Don't get away from me, Chairman. I've got him right where I want him. Think you can run from me? Not that brute again. Get back here, you miserable defect! Computer, set coordinates for the Galactic Ranger home base. Destination set. We will never make it. But hey, what are you gonna do? Oh dear.
I'll never be a ranger. Vector shell damage. Sister board appears to be intact. I must get to Alero City. Uh, they are in danger. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, who's in danger? An army is coming. I must warn them. Hang on. Slow down. You've been in a crash. What do you say we get you back to my garage? I'll run a diagnostic and have you fixed up in no time. Thank you. I appreciate the assistance. It's no problem. So, what do I call you? I suppose my proper designation is Warbot Defect B54296. Uh, maybe I'll just call you Clank. My name's Ratchet. Uh, up and down. Yeah, there you go. You're a natural. A million thoughts race through Ratchet's head. Could he repair this diminutive Warbot? Would it be the key to the adventure he craved? Did he leave the proto-engine on in the garage? The answer to all these questions was yes. All right, hang on. I'll get us back to the garage. Large gaps were child's play to Ratchet. All he would need to get across is a trusty swing shot and a little bravado. <laughs> Fortunately for our furry hero, a conveniently placed crate provided Ratchet with a combustor. Nice! A combustor! Ratchet basked in the freedom of being able to switch weapons whenever he felt like it. You could shoot something to open the door. Hey. My sensors indicate there is a switch across the way that can be activated with a combustor shot. All Ratchet had to do was shoot the target, but he thought long and hard before pulling the trigger. Impressive shooting.
Blark? What are they doing here? I have information in my data banks that poses a threat to Chairman Dreck. He must have tracked my position to your planet, so he could get it back. Ratchet was in a bad way. Hurt, confused, and alone. He scoured the Kizzle Plateau for signs of nanotech. Ratchet had to think fast. Perhaps the hookshot would solve his current conundrum. Grim, listen to me. I want you to lock the garage doors and then head down into the shelter. I'll be there as soon as I can. Copy that, Ratchet. Dropship? Correct. Model X6Z to be exact. Also known as the Dropship of Death. some defect.
detected. Destroy target. More bots. I'm down in the shelter. Ratchet, this place is a mess. Disassembled weapons and engine parts everywhere. Didn't you tell me you were going to clean it up last week? Yeah, sorry about that. Got held up on a project. A beginner's guide to quantum burst engines. Just throw that anywhere. I have it bookmarked. Well, what's this? Fun with singularities and other cataclysmic events. <laughs> That's really more for educational purposes. It is always good to meet a fellow academic. Really, I just look at the pictures and then, you know, wing it. Can you open up? Ratchet, why is Zoni's name just exploded? Sorry about that, Grim. Listen, get my tools ready. I just found something in the desert I need to look at. Interesting. What kind of factory is this? This? No, this is just a garage. Lived here since I was a kid. Come on, let's get you fixed up. Once they were safe, Clank explained Drek's plan to attack the Hall of Heroes. With the Galactic Rangers out of the equation, Ratchet knew he had to help, even though neither he nor Clank had the upper body strength necessary for hero work. I can totally help. Oh, I could not ask a civilian to get involved in something so dangerous. Well, no, I'm not just a civilian. The Rangers are actually my, uh, friends. Why do you think I have so many pictures of them? But why are you not in any of them? Well, someone had to take the picture, right? I mean, come on. I even have a ship. It disassembles so it can infiltrate enemy strongholds. <laughs> so what do you say? That's strange. I'm picking up something from Navalis. It appears to be some sort of distress signal, but it is being jammed using a Blargian signal dampener. Don't worry. The computer would have told us if we were in any real danger. Fatal crash imminent. Would you like to record your last will and testament? Admittedly, that's not super promising. Well, it's damaged, but I've fixed worse. Come on, maybe there's someone in town who can help us. <laughs> 